That was half a year ago. Yep, it's been half a year since we played Napoli. Six months ago at San Paolo, we got that 1-1 draw, which we'll be talking about in a second. But it's funny enough that exactly one year ago, 8th of August 2019, we were also facing a Napoli that was in Miami at the Hot Rock Stadium for a friendly game. What a year! Who would have thought we would be right here exactly one year later? Wearing our mask, obviously, because we're about to get inside the stadium and check out what exactly are the differences that the UEFA has set up in respect to La Liga. For now, we're getting the same access through that door. Let's see, let's see, we're nervous, we're hyped up. difference in respect to La Liga is that there is an inscription here it's not Mexican club anymore only now you can see more than a club in English too and there used to be a text that said we all play um, it's not there anymore now there's more than a club so everywhere in the world they will be able to see this message from here to come know to the world We're two hours away from kickoff and the players must be almost here um, so let's go and film that for Instagram All the players are here, so let's have a commentary on today's squad list because there's a lot to talk about. I think for us is that there are some players out for today. No Sergio Busquets or Arturo Vidal who are out for suspension. We don't have Dembele or Martin Braithwaite for tonight neither. But instead we've got Lenglet back with us, we've got Griezmann back with us. We've got two players who were not supposed to play this game if it had been played back in March. Luis Suarez and Sergio Roberto who were out for injury and they will be here tonight. And finally it's a squad full and plenty of Barca B players. We'll see how many of them end up playing this clash against Napoli. A lot happened six months ago and more stuff happened yesterday. Let's recap what's the situation of the Champions League right now at the moment. Yesterday Madrid got out in the hands of Manchester City and Juventus out too in the hands of Olympic Lyonnais. Atalanta, PSG, Atleti and Leipzig are already in the quarterfinals. They qualified back in March and today we're playing same as Bayern and Chelsea. The Blues are playing in Germany and it's going to be pretty hard for them, not to say impossible. But this is the Champions League. Um, crazy things happen in this competition. Never say never. We'll see what happens. Kick off at the same time that us. Um, we'll be following that game with one eye. Watch. just started his warm-up and so are uh, doing uh, the Napoli players who just stepped on the grass of Camp Nou and this is it finally um, only 25 minutes to go until kickoff and it's finally time it's finally time six months later 165 days later actually Meaning we 
already know the lineup. So these are the 11 players that will start today's game against Napoli. Mark their second in goal with Semedo Piqué, Lenglet and Jordi Alba in defense. Sergio Roberto, Ivan Rakitic and Frankie de Jong in midfield. And the forward line is for the MST for Leo Messi, for Luis Suarez and Antoine Griezmann. These are the 11 players that will start this final clash. Before that, there's going to be a moment of silence in the memory and of all the lives lost due to the COVID-19 pandemic and also the players will be wearing a thank you message just right above the badge and this is a UEFA initiative actually all the teams that are playing this last 16, last 8 whatever you want to call it will be wearing this thank you message it's going to be in Catalan, gracias and together with that minute of silence that's the tribute that the players will make to all the people that we've lost during this very difficult month 10 minutes to go, it's almost here. Juan, what's your prediction? My prediction, my prediction, my prediction, 3-1. Three, 3-1. One. Three, one. Three, one. That's his prediction, but let's see around the world because it's not almost 10 p.m. here, but I know people are following from all around the world, so let's check out where are all the coolers watching the game from home. What time is it? Hello, everyone. Uh, I am in Baku, the local time 11 p.m. I'm here. In Queens, New York, it's 3 p.m. Forza Barça! Hi, Kuwait City, here it is 10 p.m. Forza Barça! Visca Barça, Visca Catalunya! I'm from Mumbai, it's almost 12.30 a.m. in India, um, Forza Barça! We're here in San Diego, it's 12 noon, Forza Barça! And my score prediction is 2-0 uh, for Barcelona and the goals from Messi and Antoine Griezmann. 3-1 for Barcelona. 2-0. One Messi and one gold Suarez. Score today is going to be three to one Barcelona. Let's go. Let's get them playing. Let's get them playing. And I know that the moment the Champions League anthem plays, it's going to be. because if Napoli scores a goal, that means extra time and that would be awful. Try not to concede, but overall, go and get that second goal. Go and get it! Extraordinary goal by Leo Messi to put us two up with that super necessary goal that we were talking about. Here we are, here we got it. Minute 24 in the first half and we are already two up to Napoli, Lenglet and Leo Messi. Impressive goal as for amazing one. Messi is on the floor and he's touching his leg. He's in pain. He's in pain, oh my god. He's in pain. goal from a free kick uh, the moment we're going into halftime because we've already played uh, what was the injury time of this first half so it's now 3-1 the result we go into halftime with it's a shame but we're still on all right guys we've just hit halftime it's 3-1 thoughts three on 3-1 goals by Langley Messi Suarez it's been an action-packed first half so and good. we want more goals in the second half we want more goals and we're gonna get it Let's go! So it's what we gotta do right now is change sides because we're um, at their south goal at the moment. We need to go to the north goal um, to be behind the goal that Barca is attacking into. So let's go there. We've been playing a bit slow since the second half started so it's probably it would probably be a very good moment for a substitution and we've got Ricky Puchan Sofati and Monchu warming up on the side 
So let's see if they come in and bring some extra spark to the team because Napoli are pushing hard. So we really need to be careful there. in for Griezmann and that's Monchu's debut with Barca's first team after an amazing season with Barca B with a reserve team 10 goals scored this season here getting his first minutes with the first team on a Champions League game about to qualify for the quarterfinals <laughs> two minutes ago this is it Cules that's the Barca anthem playing in the background because we qualified into the quarterfinals we'll see you in Lisboa we'll be there with Juan and everyone uh, Oh my god, the excitement! So, okay, thoughts on the game? I congratulate all coolers over the world. Barca, Barca, Barca. Bring on FC Bayern München. Let's go. Champions League. It's back. We are lucky because we are supporting the team has Messi. Visca Barca, Visca Catalonia. So it hasn't been easy, the result is great, but it hasn't been easy. Six months later, we are into the quarterfinals. We'll be facing Bayern next week. This is going to happen in Lisboa. A lot of things are coming up, so follow us everywhere because we'll be providing you with so, so, so much content. And if you want to be just like one of these coolers who have appeared in the vlog or they are featuring in the Barca Live shows like Barca Live, you can write us, you can uh, send us an email to live at fcbarcelona.cat and we'll try and feature as many of you as we can throughout all the games that are left to be played in this Champions League next challenge Bayern Munich it's going to be hard they've won 4-1 against Chelsea tonight um, in Munich and yep next time we'll face them in uh, in Lisboa so we'll see you there that's it that was everything from Camp Nou until the next week Lisboa um, if you enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a like a thumbs up you can subscribe to Barca's YouTube channel somewhere over here on your screen and we'll see you soon with more Barca content follow us everywhere see you there bye